In our today's lesson, we will try to understand how to read beads in numbers. Here we can see digit rods. We assume that the rod at right side is home digit rod that represents ones. If we move towards left side, the rod present here represents tens and then hundreds. Let's start. Always write your start time in the beginning and finish time at the end. This practice will help you to keep track of your overall time taken for completing worksheet. You will take three examples. Then you can practice on worksheet by yourself. Here you can see three beads on one's rod. Remember, beads below the beam represents one. 2, 3, 4. How many beads towards the bar? Yes. 1, 2, 3. The number represents here is 3. Let's practice one more. Here you can see beads on 1's rod as well as tens rod. How many beads towards the bar in ones rod? Let's see. Let's recall. The bead above the beam represents five. So five, six, seven. The number representing on this digit rod is 7. On tens rod there is only one bead representing 10 as it is below the bar. 10 and 7, 17. Lastly, here beads are in all three rods that is ones, tens, and hundreds rod. Check and convert first ones rod. It's five as it is above the beam. Then tens rod. Ten, twenty. It's twenty. Hundreds rod. One hundred. 200, 300, 400. It's 400. All together it is 425. I hope you are able to solve this worksheet easily. Don't forget to note your time taken before starting solution. So let's solve the worksheet.